in your dashboard click on the design tab go to paste templates now click on the create a template button you will be redirected to name that page of template uh, here you can give the name as an example template there are more options down you can click or change the options I have users don't use the template start from the scratch and there are more advanced options you can customize it now click on create and go to add content and there is an error which says that the name already exists so choose a different name here it's example temp1 now click on create and go to content now you will be redirected to the page where you start designing so click on the layout on the right side of the page add more layout elements according to the columns size here I'm adding for example hundred percent column width or you can even add more sizes from 33 plus 434 plus 33 now go to the content here you can see more widgets where you can add for example I'm adding an image widget then I'm adding a content block widget and you can even also choose from navigation widgets I've dropped it and then again something like blogs list widget now I'll add one more like events widget and let me choose from a different okay I'll add a download list widget here now I'll edit this uh, or I'll select an image first okay I'll edit the download list first so here I'll edit my list and then save it uh, now I'll select an image for example here I'll select an image from my local PC this is an example image so I'll just now just click on the save button now I'll add some more content to the content block for example you can even change your heading styles font styles for example I'll just write it as resistance technologies click on the save button after your changes are done now just click on publish button so in here we'll click on the pages tab where we can create a page it will be redirected to obviously naming the page so just give a name to the page here I'll be using as uh, example page so there are many advanced options if you would like to change or else just use your template that you have created earlier from the select another template button click on it and you'll be redirected to choose your template that has been created earlier so here is our example temp1 click on it and then just click on done now if you need to give 
more options for like description you can type your description here and you can give the keywords for managing your SEO and there are many more advanced options where you can adjust according to your need you can even allow your site index to search this page external engines to search this place or if you require SSL or if you need a parameter validation or a conical URL etc etc now they just click on create and go to add content after you finished your changes now you can add more content like if you if you want to add another layout element here you can just drag and drop for example here I'll add layout element and then a content block widget even I'll add a list widget now I'll click on the list to display what I want uh, for example here I'll use the select list as location now click on done settings click on save now we'll get the locations list in the list widget now you want to add content I'll just use my example content just click on the save and your content will appear in the content block scroll up and see if you want to add anything else or else just click on the preview button to see how your page looks like after finishing just publish by clicking on the publish button now you'll get your page listed in the pages list you can find it here it says example page click on the view button you'll be redirected to your page that is created thank you for watching